Hello everyone, you are welcome to solve this nice exponential equation which is 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x this is equal to 50. What is the value of x given that x is not equal to 0? So let's prevent the solution from here. Now since 5 to the power of x is common here, we can factor out 5 to the power of x so that now here we have 1 plus 1 plus 1 this is equal to 50 so here we have 5 to the power of x multiplied by 1 plus 1 plus 1 this is 3 and this is equal to 50 let's divide both signs by 3 so that now here we have 5 to the power of x this is equal to 50 over 3 so for x here, we introduce logarithm here. So we have rho 5 to the power of x. This is equal to rho. Now this is 50 over 3. You find that rho 5 to the power of x, this is in the form of rho e to the power of n, which can be expressed as n rho a. Applying this power root property, then rho 5 to the power of x becomes x rock 5 this is equal to rock 50 divided by 3 let's divide both signs by rock 5 and also here by rock 5 so let's simplify here so that x is equal to now this is rock 50 divided by 3 divided by rho 5. Now we find that rho 50 over 3, this is in the form of rho a over b, and this can be expressed as rho a minus rho b. Let's apply this property so that now here we have x equal to rho 50 divided by rho 5, Subtract rock 3 divided by rock 5. The next step from here, we can express 50 basically as 10 multiplied by 5. So here we have x equal to rock. This is 10 times 5 divided by rock 5. Subtract rock 3 divided by rock 5. Now here we have rock 10 times 5. This is in the form of rock A times B, which we can express as rock A plus rock B. Applying this property, then here we have x equal to rock 10 over rock 5, then plus rock 5, divided by rho 5, subtract rho 3, divided by rho 5. Let's simplify here, rho 5 and rho 5, so this is 1, so that x here is equal to 1 plus rho 10, divided by rho 5, subtract rho 3, divided by rho 5. The next step here, we can express 10 as 5 multiplied by 2. So that now, here we have x equal to 1 plus, this is rho, 5 multiplied by 2, divided by rho 5, then subtract rho 3, divided by rho 5. So rho 5 times 2, this again is in the form of rock A times B, which can be expressed as rock A plus rock B. So here we have x equal to 1 plus rock 5 divided by rock 5, then plus rock 2 divided by rock 5, subtract rock 3 divided by rock 5. 
and this implies that here rock 5 and rock 5 simplifies so this is 1 so that now we have x equal to 1 plus 1 this is 2 plus rock 2 divided by rock 5 subtract rock 3 divided by rock 5 you find that rock 2 over rock 5 and rock 3 over rock 5 this is in the form of rock a over rock b which we can express as rock a to base b so let's apply this logarithm property so that now x here is equal to 2 plus this is rock 2 to base 5 minus rock 3 to base 5 so this is the value of x from here the next step is to verify that this value of x satisfies the equation let's verify that this value of x satisfies the equation if you recall we end that 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x this is equal to 50. Since 5 to the power of x is common here, we can factor out 5 to the power of x. So this is 1 plus 1 plus 1 here. This is equal to 50. So here we have 5 to the power of x times 1 plus 1 plus 1. This is 3. This is equal to 50. So let's divide both signs by 3. So that now 5 to the power of x here this is equal to 50 over 3 so let's substitute x and check if we have 50 over 3 so this is 5 raised to the power of 2 plus rock 2 to base 5 minus rock 3 to base 5 this is supposed to give us a value of 50 over 3 so 5 to the power of 2 plus rock 2 to base 5 minus rock 3 to base 5. This is in the form of a to the power of n plus m, which you can express as a to the power of n times a to the power of m. And again, a to the power of n minus m. This can be expressed as a to the power of n divided by a to the power of m. Applying these two exponent properties, here we have 5 to the power of 2 times 5 to the power of rho 2 to base 5 divided by 5 raised to the power of rho 3 to base 5 this is supposed to give us a value of 50 over 3 so 5 squared this is equal to 25 multiplied by now 5 to the power of rho 2 to base 5 and 5 raised to the power of rock 3 to base 5. This is in the form of a to the power of rock b to base a, which essentially is equal to b. Let's apply this property so that you have 5 to the power of rock. This is 2 to base 5, and this is equal to 2. And 5 raised to the power of rock 3 to base 5, this is equal to 3. Let's substitute these two. So that now, here we have 25 times 2 divided by 3. This should give us a value of 50 over 3. Now, we have 25 times 2. This is equal to 50 divided by 3. And this is equal to 50 divided by 3. So this reaffirms that the right add side is equal to the right add side. And this confirms that the value of x, which is equal to, this is 2 plus rock 2 to base 5 minus rock 3 to base 5, actually satisfies the equation. So can you follow the steps? Like this video and subscribe like this video and subscribe now see you in the next video
bye bye for now